As we're watching the water rise in the Ohio Valley today, it's not a new site for people who have lived here for a while. We're taking a look back at a historic flooding in our community to put today's per flooding into perspective. 1964, the second worst flood in Louisville history. We had bad floods way before this video, but this is as far back as our vault takes us. This is Valley Station underwater. March 12, 1964, the Ohio River crested at 41.2 feet. Uh, about 100 to 150 families down there that we can't seem to convince that they ought to move out. Fast forward to March 7th of 1997. That time the river crested at 38.76 feet and the precipitation just kept coming and coming and coming. Not severe storms, but they are very heavy. Anytime it was by far storm. the most rain ever to fall in this area in 24 hours. Storm sewers and streams were overwhelmed. Okalona and Fairdale were particularly hard hit. Neighbors grabbing their bags, their pets, and each other to get out. Dad, I gave me the choice to get out now or suffer the consequences because it was getting so deep back in the trailer park. I live like right next to the Gene Snyder, so they pulled me out. Then in August of 2009, a flash flood after eight inches of rain fell in just 75 minutes. The northwestern part of Louisville was the hardest hit and Churchill Downs was underwater. It all happened so quickly, people couldn't have prepared. Loved ones struggle to check on each other. I can't get to her. And I mean, look at me. I'm, I'm nervous. I'm hectic. I'm, I'm trying to find some way to get over to get to her right now and stuff, man. Then most recently, the flooding in 2018. The Ohio crested the upper gauge at 35.8 feet, putting much of Louisville and southern Indiana underwater. We all know some of the worst parts of flooding are the water receding and cleaning up what's left behind. So you have Val's football team joined in on the effort. They help us during the season. So whenever whenever something like this happens, you know, they, I want them to be able to see that we can be called on too to help out. Looking at this drone video from Thursday morning, we're not reaching those levels. The upper is about 27 feet right now and is expected to crest just over 29 this weekend. That's currently about 15 feet above normal and more than four feet above flood stage.